everybody in this video I want to share with you anti-aging face mask uh, with blackberries and sour cream but this mask can be also suitable for dry skin if you have dry skin and plus anti-aging mask so you can use it um, and also as I said you can be younger lady and still have dry skin so you can use it too I have oily skin and I always was using mask for oily skin but now in the winter the, my skin is getting drier I don't know why and so I, I use this mask for myself and it moisturizes my skin even very good even though I have oily skin and it's, I, I feel my skin looks very ugly in summer I have to do all stuff of all bunch of mask so let me show you how to do this mask I already mashed um, berries and the only you need here maybe two berries for this mask for any mask you make just two berries is enough here I already mashed a few berries to for to make with a uh, video um, because I'm making a few videos but you're gonna make with just mask for yourself and just mash two berries I just put them together in the cup and squeeze them with fingers no need anything any blenders because for two berries you don't need to turn on blender or juicer right it's just gonna make everything dirty and it will be hard to collect all this together so and we're gonna add here a tablespoon of berries and you don't need to add a lot there just like that and the other thing I want to tell you you also can if you have dry skin you can just take a juice of the berries like tablespoon of juice and tablespoon of water and mix it in a cup and deep cotton pad and just wipe your face with it and that way you don't have to worry that the drops, uh, pieces of uh, berry will fall down on your clothes and make you dirty. If you have dry skin, a uh, tablespoon of uh, berries juice and tablespoon of water, just mix it and dip cotton bath. If you have oily skin, you just need a tablespoon of this juice, no water, nothing added. And uh, if you have mature fatting skin, uh, instead of water, add a tablespoon of milk, like tablespoon juice of berries, a tablespoon of milk, mix and um, dip cotton pot. It will be very good for ma uh, mature skin fighting and just wipe your face with it. So here I want to show you the mask for aging skin and also suitable for dry skin. Because you know dry skin uh, gets wrink get wrinkles earlier than other type of skin. Because it's dry and even people with dry skin smiles, it shows that they have wrinkles even though they may not have it. But visually it shows that they have some wrinkles. And we're going to add here just a teaspoon of sour cream. Why a teaspoon? Because it's already liquid and uh, it's not a, a hard, uh, not, not something uh, like heavy mask. So you just can mix it, it's all going to be kind of liquid. And if you add more table uh, or more sour cream, it's just gonna be just sort of like a red water, you know. So just add teaspoon, and it's enough. I add just teaspoon for myself, and even though I have oily skin, I, I just getting so dry in the winter. So I use this mask, and it works great for me. It moisturizes it and make it very soft. So this mask, when you apply on, when you do any uh, anti-aging face mask. Or not just anti aging any mask you need to apply this not only on your face also on your neck and the collet zone because they get older faster than the face skin so you don't want to have it keep pushing on your face and make it very you look young and neck and the collet zone looks bad so always apply uh, everywhere to keep all um, in the same age and 10, 15, 20 minutes is enough you know, for this mask. Your skin will absorb everything what you need. And uh, I want to say this mask, you do not do it while you're working and doing stuff in the house. And do not even add here flour because oh, I always say add some flour to make it heavier. But because this is even if one drop falls down on your clothes, you're going to get angry and mad. And uh, n uh, this kind of stuff doesn't need to make you mad, right? <laughs> because you want to make yourself happy so this mask you just do when you are in the bathtub take a shower just squeeze a few berries and do mask, make this mask and go to the bathtub apply everything there while you take a shower your pores will be open because of the hot water and hot steam and they will be clean easier because this also has as you know seeds inside small seeds they also will work like a light scrub so 
and also uh, I have ability to tighten the pores I forgot to say about it uh, it also help to tighten the pores so when you are leaving the shower bathtub just um, wash away this it will help to tighten the pores and also don't forget to wash your face with cool water because cool water close pores it's great to close pores don't forget about cool water because if you leave the shower and your pores are open you're gonna keep getting stuff in it if you go outside everything from outside will stuck to your face so you don't want that don't forget to wash with cool water all the time thank you for watching this video and watch my other videos thank you